I also wanted to show you, so now I'm right outside the front door. Here's the little platform area. And then if you swing right, they've got a little fountain here. Not sure if it works, but I don't think it's plugged in right now. And then if you pan to the left, it's really nicely landscaped. And then you walk out. You've got grass in front and then a sidewalk area. It's really kind of tucked in and private. And then out to the street. Okay guys, I just walked in the front door. The front door's on my back. If I pan left, I've got a formal dining room. Straight ahead goes to the kitchen. And to the right is a formal living room and has a nice TV mounted, mounted in a fireplace. The ceilings are really nice and tall. I'm gonna walk straight ahead and to the right is a wet bar that has a wine cooler and a sink and some nice cabinets. Over here is a nice little closet come back here and I'm going to turn around here. I'm going to continue walking and make to the left and there's your formal, your family room that goes out to the pool area and patio and then pan left is the kitchen that's open to the family room. has a nice island in it. Tons of pat pantry cabinets. Let's see if they've got some pullouts. Ooh, they've got a little doggy. Um, okay, so we're going to walk around the kitchen. has some nice appliances, built-in microwave. It's got dishwasher, island, the granite is really pretty. Five burner stove. And then it looks like the only thing they didn't do in the house was the, the uh, laminate countertop in uh, the laundry room. And then in the garage, here, here's the door off the kitchen to the garage. It's a two-car garage. Has some cabinets. It also has some storage area. It's pretty deep. You can put cabinets in there as well. And then they've got some shelving down the side. All right, let's go back in. And move back through the kitchen. If I make a right, we're back at the formal dining room off the entry, so it's right off the kitchen area. And then I can go right or I can go left off the family room. So it's a split floor plan, which I like. I'm going to go to the right first. And here's the hallway for the two bedrooms. Here's the bathroom. It all That door straight ahead is a uh, door out to the uh, pool, so it's a pool bath. And then it's got a really nice shower in it with also, there's the toity and some linen closet area. And then we're going to go back out. I'm sorry if I'm making you guys dizzy. And make a left. And here's another bedroom. They're all really nice size. And they both have, has a window to the outside to the backyard. And they all have a really nice walk-in closet. Pretty nice size and pretty deep. Then we're going to go back out this bedroom across the hall. And into another nice size bedroom. Which has a big window out to the side yard. And then also this is, I think, part of the atrium that's off the family room. But you can't see through. So it is totally private. And then another really nice size closet. Okay, we're gonna go back out. Past the bathroom. Back out through the hallway. And now, bang, we're back in the family room and the kitchen. Now I'm gonna go straight across. And now I'm in, I'm walking into a huge master suite that has an extra area 
that I don't know if at some point in time was probably added on, but it's really nicely done with all the house has crown molding. Um, and this is a really nice size office area. So it's kind of like three bedrooms and a sitting room, a den, or it could be another office. So there's extra space. And I like the fact the master has French doors out to the patio and pool. Then we're going to enter in to the master bath. It's got dual vanities. They're the nice high ones. Nice cabinets. And then straight ahead is the closet with really nice built-ins. Up and down and lots of storage for shoes. And then I'm gonna back out of the closet and I'm gonna pan left. And you've got a jacuzzi tub and shower. And then a little vanity area here that has more built-ins more built-in cabinets, and a nice mirror. And then you got a se separate little pooper right there. Okay, let's go out. I'm gonna rush out because this is getting kind of long. Let's go out and see the backyard. So here we go, out the back doors. And you've got patio. Nice space here. More space there. I'm going to walk this way. And look around the side of the house on one side. You've just got storage area down there. And then patio. There's the door that comes from the, the guest bath, pool bath. And then you've got the really nice pool. It looks like it's been refinished and replastered. looks brand new. And you've also got grass and an RV gate on the other side, which is nice to have. All right, guys, I'm going to head home and send it to you and see what you guys think. Okay, bye. I also wanted to show you, so now I'm right outside the front door. Here's the little platform area. And then if you swing right, they've got a little fountain here. Not sure if it works, but I don't think it's plugged in right now. And then if you pan to the left, it's really nicely landscaped. And then you walk out. You've got grass in front and then a sidewalk area. It's really kind of tucked in and private. And then out to the street.